Hi guys. We're going to talk again about a personal narrative. Personal narrative is a story that you write about something that happened to you. Yesterday, you did an assignment where you had to come up with five ideas and pick one that was your favorite. That one you chose that was your favorite is what we're going to be doing a planning sheet on today. Now what I'm getting ready to show you is an example. You are not copying my example. You will be creating a planning sheet, but it will be on your idea, not mine. So right now, just watch. We are going to be using your spiral notebook, the one with the little twisty thing on it. And we are going to be creating this planning sheet inside that notebook. I'll show you what it looks like in just a minute. On the board, I've started one. It's going to say personal narrative at the top. The B is for beginning, the M is for middle, and the E is for end. I drew a little box for a picture for the beginning. The middle has three boxes and the end has one. These are for little doodles, not Mr. Kreger art, just quick doodles to help your brain remember what it is you want to say. And here I'm going to jot a quick list of things that I'm going to talk about in my story. Now my personal narrative is about a reading challenge that I accepted as my goal when I was a kid. So the first thing was mom took me to the library. Now, I didn't write this in nice sentences because it's really just a list. I'm brainstorming ideas. So they don't have to be in complete full sentences. It's just to help your brain remember. I looked at the books. I could hear the clock ticking because it was so quiet. my picture it is a picture of the bookcase now for the middle hold on drop something for the middle the librarian came to tell me about the prizes the librarian told me about prizes. The prizes that I chose um, were a pizza coupon and a new book. But she gave me a prize chart. She gave me a prize chart. Okay, I drew a little picture right here that says prizes to remind my brain that she gave me a prize chart. Then I picked out a book to read. She helped me choose a book. I chose Wonder. It took forever to read. Now, Again, I'm just making a quick list of the things that did happen to me as I was making this goal for myself. I'm gonna use these sentences to build a big story. It's not gonna be this short, but this is a good starting place. So I drew a picture of the book Wonder. My last box is where I'm going to tell about all of the books I read. I read six more books. I read for 1,200 minutes. So that's the last box I have for the middle. These three here are the middle section. The first box is my beginning and this last section is going to be my end. In the end, I met my reading goal. 
I got a pizza coupon and a new book. Now, the picture that I included in my end was of a pizza because I got to go eat pizza with my dad and it's of me holding up my book and my pizza coupon. This is a planning sheet for my paper. You are not writing about a reading goal. You are writing about your idea. So your planning sheet is going to look different than this one. Now I'm going to go get my notebook and show you what I want your notebook to look like. This is the spiral notebook. I want you to use your pencil and you're going to write personal narrative at the top. Feel free to pause the video so you can draw the lines. You're going to make one box for beginning with a section to write down your notes. You're going to make three boxes for the middle with a section to write down your notes. And you're going to make one box for the end with a little section to write down your notes. You are going to use this to plan your personal narrative. I happened to see one submission before I made this video and it was I want to be a better volleyball player. So if that's your goal, you're going to tell me about all the things that you are currently doing and are going to plan to do in your story. When did you start playing volleyball? When did you start working extra hard? Who is it that you talked to that helped you succeed? Beginning, middle, and end. Happy planning!